Stop it. Get some help. Today, today we are reacting to Chainsaw Man episode two, guys. How are you all doing today? You excited to see this episode? I know it's coming into you late. Hey, your boys gotta do what your boys gotta do. I got a real life outside of this, but you know how it is. I'm still here to react to Chainsaw Man episode two for you guys today. And I'm so excited to get into this because first episode really blew my socks off with its animation, the art, like the world just seems so alive with it. Mappo is doing an amazing job with it. I mean, obviously I haven't not read the manga, so I have no idea like if it's a good adaptation one-to-one, -one. you guys will have to let me know down in the comment section down below what you're thinking about this adaptation so far if you're a manga reader of course try to leave the spoilers out of it i do want to point out that i actually didn't know the the characters names last time when i was watching the first episode but i actually did learn some of the characters names in the last week so i know the girl that he met at the end of last week's episode her name's makima and she's the girl with the business suit with the big ass that i always see on social media and then the other girl the one with the horns that reminded me of zero two uh she, her name is power and so that makes sense from the opening uh, with her in the bikini it had power underneath her so it was literally her and that might have been actually a reference to Thor Ragnarok somebody pointed out and that opening honestly I found out later on was just like it was full of references it was just full of references uh, to different movies and like all these different uh, works of fiction and art so like that's pretty cool and I didn't recognize like almost any of them the one I did recognize at the end though when they pointed it out was the uh, Adam Sandler movie with the bowling ball in the opening when he was doing that when Denji was doing that uh, with, the, with the gold bowling ball and uh, apparently there was a shit ton of uh, testicle references in it too so like that opening is way better than I even get credit for when I saw it. So like, I'm even more intrigued. I'm gonna watch it again today. And I heard there's actually a new ending too. There's gonna be a new ending for each episode, which is kind of cool. So we'll actually throw that on to the reaction as well at the end of the episode. So anyway, guys, I hope you guys are excited to see this episode today. I am really, really excited. If you end up enjoying the video, enjoyed the reaction, and you wanna see more of this kind of anime on the channel, make sure to leave the video a like for me. It really helps me out. And don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel, cause that's how you'll get notified when I post new videos, which I do one video every single day. Pretty much, uh, we're doing a lot of Bleach right now. We're doing some other shows this season that you should definitely check out, Eminence and Shadow, which is gonna come out tomorrow. That show is definitely a sleeper, so look out for that. But yeah, I really appreciate the support, guys. Without further ado, let's get into this week's episode. Here she is. <laughs> He's hungry. I like her voice. Oh my god, he's so cute. Denji-kun. Oh. <laughs> yes or woofer answers. She wants him as a dog. We put them down. So Denji's gonna have to be the best little doggy he can be. <laughs> she is a little scary, huh? <laughs> You, you love it though. What? Oh. Oh, Pochita. Oh. Hey, yo. She is. I like her so far. This is the first time somebody's really been nice to him. Oh. <laughs> Oh, his heart, you can hear his heart beating. He loves her already? <laughs> Pretty quick. Oh, oh, he got the booba face. He got the booba in his face. <laughs> this guy is everybody. This is every dude right here. Just when you get the face, the booba in the face. Oh, man. <laughs> That's the face you make. <laughs> I love this guy already. <laughs> oh. Because she, they were really good friends. Mm. So is he one of very few? So he's one of the only people this has ever happened to? Uh, oh. Aww. He's so alive. Oh. So he is still there, kind of. 
Uh, oh, he's gonna pass out again. <laughs> oh no, he didn't even get to eat a sausage. Udon, he's oh a. That's a good view. <laughs> that's what he wanted. <laughs> this man. Why? just say woof he did not just answer actually answer with woof oh my god he's a dog <laughs> y'all said y'all said denji was a simp all the manga readers that i've ever interacted with are like denji's a simp <laughs> this man reacted he said woof <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah you are a dog now makima, makima. hey going straight there <laughs> <laughs> oh. My dude. He's getting it. You get it, Denji. <laughs> You're in there. You're in there like swimwear, boy. Oh, we're in the city. Oh, she's not with him anymore? Oh, you didn't actually get to say it to him. Say it to her. Devil Hunter Tokyo Headquarters. So this is Tokyo, huh? Looks like smaller than I'm used to. Uh, uh, yeah, he's already thinking about that. I love it. <laughs> he wants to fuck her. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy, Denji. <laughs> Man's a simp. I love it. Okay. Does he know how to tie a tie? Oh! There he is! That's the guy from the opening! Aki. He's got a sword. <laughs> oh. Back to reality! <laughs> <laughs> He's pouting like a child. Oh, there's some little carrot for you. She's gonna tie his tie for him. Bro, that's hot. Dude. There you go. There's your goal right there, Denji. <laughs> He's not even gonna answer him. Oh, you got the shit kicked out of him? What? Oh. Why? Because he said that to, about Makima? He's going to show up. Oh, he's not in it for the money. He's in it for the booba. <laughs> Got it. There's no way he's gonna take this sitting down. Right? He's just gonna follow him. Oh, in the balls! You did not just kick this man in the balls, Denji. Oh, no. Oh no! There goes his balls! Oh my god, that hurts so bad! I'm cringing because I've. If you've ever been kicked in the balls before, that shit hurts. And you just got nailed in the balls like five times! Yeah. Let's go, Denji. Oh, oh, we're gonna have a full fight in the alleyway, huh? Oh, he likes her too. Oh, oh, I think he <laughs> in the balls again. I would just throw up by now. 
He's gonna pass out, dude. That yeah, that shit hurts. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> I like how you guys are taking it off. Uh, uh... Wait, does he know about? He just probably doesn't know about Denji's power. <laughs> I feel like they're gonna end up. Ah, uh, you know what? Oh yes. Uh, ah, yes. Yes, she did say that. So he, he can't leave. He's there. He's there with them forever. We went from them fighting in the street to now they're going to live together. He's going to be the straight lace guy for all the jokes, huh? That that's definitely going to be a point of contention at some point, right? He respects the shit out of her, okay. <laughs> He's jealous. Jeez. Oh, you know what? Dude, he's going to put it on his toast. Dude, he's always had to eat toast by itself. He never got to put anything on it. We had this conversation in two of my videos last week about eating bread by itself in the bleach video and in the chainsaw man video when he got only got to eat bread by itself and now he's because he has all the things he's gonna put it all on there you know what mad respect denji i love it um is it gonna be good though <laughs> taking a bath <laughs> splish splash taking a bath <laughs> he's taking a shit <laughs> he fell asleep taking a shit he used all the toilet paper and left it. No, wait, that's actually the worst. Wait, that's actually, I'm sorry. I, I love you, Denji, but that's actually the worst. You cannot leave the toilet paper roll empty. That is just so disrespectful. Gosh. Oh. Okay, so a new devil is here. He's got an ax with him? A fiend. Yes. Takes control of a human corpse. Okay. Characteristic heads. Birds? Oh! He's got like a freaking... He looks like a beetle nose. He just chopped his head off. Oh. Oh. Okay. This is good advice, probably. Oh, shit. Damn. Oh. Interesting. Oh, yeah, because of Pochita. Oh, he doesn't like that. But, but Pochita was a good devil, though. It's definitely going to be a point of contention at some point as well about this whole devils. Are all devils bad? Are they all horrible, horrible beings? Like, Pochita obviously was this cute little devil that after getting to know Denji was pretty much harmless for in terms of other people like he would just would have just lived basically as denji's dog forever like legitimately so like honestly i think this is going to come back later on in an important story arc i'm sure these two fighting against each other maybe because of that <laughs> denji dude he just wanted to keep the blood off the porn. <laughs> he just wanted to look at the porn. Porn is secured. <laughs> He's, every day is living the dream. All he wants is to live like a normal person. Something's missing for you too, Denji? 
Oh. Some revenge shit. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Denji. He wants to touch the boobs. Okay. I love you, Denji. I love you, man. I respect it. That's his next goal. <laughs> that was the second part of his trip. <laughs> That's what he meant. <laughs> Touch <laughs> your boobies. A partner? Not Aki? Oh, is this gonna be the other girl? It is. Power. She's a fiend. Oh. 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 <laughs> what is that stance? <laughs> I, what is she doing? <laughs> she also has boobs. <laughs> Denji! <laughs> Fucking legend, bro! I love this guy. I love this man. Power Chan. Experimental Unit. Special Division 4. So they're kind of similar in that way. Oh, they're gonna be two peas in a pod. She's smelling something? Oh! <laughs> she provide me with something to kill? She wants blood? There's the No, don't kill the cat. True and yeah, that's pretty true. That's true and yeah, that's true. That's true. <laughs> How do I get my hands on those boobs? It's her fault. Oh. Maybe that was the idea. <laughs> he, did, he wanted to get Denji off of him. Oh, she smelled something. Oh, she's... And she's off! <laughs> Uh, whoa, she's mental. Oh, she's just jumping. Oh, blood hammer. Yo. Oh, <laughs> it exploded. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yo. I mean, she's bloodthirsty. Oh, here's the new ending. What? It's funky. He's in the garbage. Oh, this design. It's almost like 8-bit almost. I like it. You sleeping in the garbage, Denji? Power? Oh. And then there's Aki. I really like these this art. Makima. Whoa. He's falling upside down. Okay. They're Okay, okay, real quick about the ending. I really liked the art in it. Like, it was very, like, 8-bit-like, very, um, you know, cartoony, stylized. I really liked it. Um, but I have to say, the song for the first ending is just so much better. It's like, the chainsaw man! Like, that one? That one is just... 
it's just way better. It's, it takes it, <laughs> it knocks it out of the park with that one. Even though the visuals for this one were way better. So that's what I'll say about the ending. Uh, new one next week too. It seems like there's gonna be a new ending every single week. So yep, short bit about the ending there, and then the episode. So Denji, man, gotta respect it, man. Just wants to just wants a little booby touch, a little booby touch. Wants to get with Makima. Can't blame him. She's pretty. She's pretty. I like it. Uh, his whole, like, literally, his whole goal is has already been reached in life. Remember, his goals were he wants to live like a normal person, eat food, bathe, like, just like be a normal person, and he finally did get it. So it's like completely a step away from other, you know, shonen type anime where it's like they have a lofty goal, like you know, One Piece. I want to be the Pirate King, Naruto. I want to be the Hokage, like like uh, Black Clover. I want to be the Wizard King, like that kind of stuff. Those lofty goals, no. Denji just wants to be a regular fucking guy and sleep with a girl, like a normal person. Like you, and he's he's already living his dream right now. <laughs> so it's like it's awesome. But uh, you know you have Aki, who we get introduced here, here who is going to be his superior and uh, the leader of his special division that Makima has put together uh, of basically misfits, um, people who are like obviously unique with power, being a fiend, which is like a person who has been taken over by a devil kind of or it's a corpse that has been taken over by a devil so she's actually a corpse that is a, that is being possessed by a devil and you have denji who is a devil that is fused with a human so you have those um so but anyway aki being the leader and he has clearly a really fucked up backstory with the devil killing his entire family in front of his eyes Apparently Makima had something to do with saving him. Maybe it has something to do with that, that that's the exact same situation where she saved him from that devil. Uh, I wonder what kind of power she has, but no. Aki being uh, the serious one in this, I can already see where this is going in terms of him being, you know, the straight man to power and Denji's like recklessness and, and craziness. It's, it's kind of like it'll kind of be like Tanjiro being the straight man in the in the in Demon Slayer with uh, Zenitsu and Inosuke just running around, or if, you know you want to liken it to One Piece with uh, you know Nami uh, being the straight laced one with you know Zoro and Luffy running around, or you know that kind of dynamic that you got going on. So, like, I already see that happening. Uh, he, his argument with Denji is tough. I think it's going to be something later on where, you know, he wants to kill all devils, but, you know, Denji has Pochita's experience, the experience with Pochita, with it basically just being a harmless dog chainsaw devil. I mean, yeah, it could hurt people, but, like, if nothing bad had happened to them and they just lived in the woods together forever, you know, he would have just been a dog. Like, so there are, there probably are good devils out there, as we saw with Pochita. And I think that's going to be a, definitely a point of conflict later on. Um, but I am really loving this show so far, guys. <laughs> like, I'm just interested to see what kind of interesting things can happen with the different kinds of devils or, like, where they came from. And, you know, are there even more intelligent devils out there that could be, like, masterminds of, like, you know, trying to kill many, 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 many people? Um, I'm sure there are. It could it kind of reminds me of Jujutsu Kaisen in the beginning like that, where it could be like there's really, really highly smart, like very, very smart devils out there that could be plotting to like kill a lot of people. So and, you know, just the characters. I just love the characters so far. I, I hope Den Denji finally does get to touch somebody's boobs, like for the love of God, like just let this man get a booby touch. Like he already got a face full of Makima's boobs. Like early in the in the episode, but I hope he gets he gets together with one of them eventually. Um, but anyway, guys, that'll have to do it for this reaction. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to leave the video a like. Thank you for all the support on YouTube. Thank you for the support on Patreon. Thank you to the God tier subscribers on Patreon for all of the help that they provide me. All of the stuff on Patreon, all of the donations, guys, they all go to helping me make this a better experience for you. So if you're interested, do check out the Patreon link below. You get the full unedited reactions with the entire anime on the screen, the entire full length episode. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I've been Zach, you've been you, and I'll see you guys all in the next one.